everybody, welcome back to my channel, Ecom Tom here, and if it seems like I'm wearing the same t-shirt that I wore in my last TrackerBot video, it's because I am, and I'm shooting all these videos in the same day. So what do I want to talk about in this video? And in this video, I want to talk about the new copy and paste semi-auto ordering program that I've been using. I've been using this primarily for Amazon dropshipping, but also I've been using have my, having my VAs use it for eBay dropshipping as well. So what is this program? How do I go about it? And what is it called? Why am I using it? So before I get into any of that, please look down, see if you subscribe to this channel. And if you haven't, please give me a subscribe. Turn on the little bell notification, because I guess I'm big enough to say that now. And some people have told me that they have turned on the bell notification. So that's pretty cool. And thank you guys who have done it. So what is this program? This program is called Spot and Paste. And if many of you guys have been following me for a while, and you guys do know that I've been using Smarty Drop. And don't get me wrong, Smarty Drop was a efficient program. It did what it needed to do, but a lot of the times it just wouldn't update on time. It would. It, there were so many errors that went on. Their customer support literally sucked ass. It literally, nobody would talk to you, nobody would message you. I tried to get deals and discounts for all of my programs, for all the students out there, all the people following me. Smarty Drop was not very responsive. They never messaged me. They only emailed me. Uh, I'm sure one of them had a Facebook. I'm, I'm guessing one of the people out there that uh, it runs Smarty Drop has a Facebook, but they would never message me. I told them to. They told me they CC'd their CEO on one of the emails. He'll get back to me. He never did. And I said, fuck you guys. There, it's, it's an awful program and it's run by a bunch of idiots. So I was reached out to by Jenny Sponton and she runs Spot and Paste. And at first I told her, I was like, this program doesn't have everything that I need or everything that I want. And she went out and she created it all. Not only did she create it all for eBay dropshipping, everything that Smarty Drop does, it also works for Amazon dropshipping, which Smarty Drop does not do. It integrates into your Amazon Seller Central. It integrates into Web Scraper app if you're using Web Scraper app. It integrates into eBay. It integrates into Amazon, did the buying account. It integrates into literally everything that you ever needed. It works on Walmart. And if, you, if it doesn't automatically copy and paste everything, it gives you the ability to copy all of the person's information and then drag it over one by one, which is a lot faster than copying and pasting. So why use a semi-auto ordering program at all? Mainly if you're doing over five sales a day or five sales are over a day and you're not using a semi-auto ordering copy and paste the address like tool, then you are wasting your time. Even if you have virtual assistants using this tool, you are wasting their time. They could be doing better things with their time than copying and pasting addresses one by one. If they only have one screen, then they have to switch in between tabs and it's just a pain in the ass. Nobody wants to be doing this. These programs make it extremely easy and extremely fast to copy and paste somebody's address from one place to another. From eBay onto Amazon, from eBay onto Walmart, from Amazon onto Walmart, anything that you want to do. Also, they give you the ability to then, like Smarty Drop had, Spot and Paste also has, where you're going to add all the people's items in at once, say so you can do like 30 or 40 at a time, and then it's going to copy and shoot over everybody's address at the same time as well. That's what we call semi-auto ordering. It's not full auto because it's not doing it for you right away. You have to be there. But for people that aren't doing massive volume, and auto ordering doesn't make sense. And for people that are doing above five, just five orders a day, that is the big range of the gap where these programs are really great. And I would say the majority of the people that are dropshipping fit in this gap. And you should be using this program. So like I said, I'm trying to get a deal for everybody out there for every single program. If you sign up through my affiliate link down below, I copped a deal for you guys and it's 10% off your subscription forever. You just have to use the coupon at the check at checkout and it's Ecom Tom. There's no spaces, no uppercases, just Ecom Tom. You'll see it in the description. You'll see it in the pinned comment below. So like I said, I use these programs, these co copy and paste semi auto ordering programs all the way up until I did about $85,000 in sales in one month only using these programs. I didn't even have auto ordering at the time. I didn't even really know auto ordering was a thing until about, I think, May of last year. And that's when I started using it, back when I start, right when I started hitting around 100, 120,000 in sales a month. So I really do think that these programs, the majority of the people out there drop swimming fit in the need for this program. If you're doing 30 sales a day, you don't necessarily need an auto ordering program when you can literally just copy and paste everybody's address, shoot it all over to Amazon and paste it all in and you know you, you ordered all of those items in one swift go in about 10 15 minutes um, that saves you if it's 10 if it's 20 cents an auto order what is that for 30 for 30 orders that's six dollars or something i don't even know that cuts out of your profit it cuts it, 20 cents an auto order i've seen 40 cents an auto order some of them are 18 some of them are 15 it really depends on what your plan is and all this different stuff what program you're using 
but for the majority of the time, it's going to cut out a decent percent, a d decent little chunk of your percentage. And if you're not doing huge, massive volume, like 100 plus orders a day, or higher just profit margins in general, then this is going to cut into your actual profit. And it's going to leave you sitting there going, wow, why am I not making as much money as possible? So I hope you guys are excited for this program. And as always, I'm going to go into the screen and show you guys how to use this program and teach you guys what to do. So I'll see you in that. All right, everybody, welcome back to the second part of the video on spot and paste. And basically, if you have not heard of spot and paste or any type of auto order, a semi auto ordering program, you need to look into this program. So I used to use Smarty Drop, as I said earlier in the video. And based off the pricing, first off, spot and paste is so much cheaper than Smarty Drop will ever be. Secondly, there's so many tutorials on the website on how to use it, where Smarty Drop only has three tutorials and it sucks. They all suck. And thirdly, look at all of the different tools that this integrates with. There's so many things for eBay. There's the fast copy. There's all sorts of different, it goes into SKU Grid if you use SKU Grid. There's the Amazon address deleter, which you know I have an app for or I've used an app for that, but you know this is added in. There's all sorts of different things. It integrates into Amazon, integrates into Shopify, integrates into AutoDS, DSM tool, Web Scraper app, which I use, SKU Grid, OA Genesis, more SKU Grid stuff. There's so many different things on here, and this is a very, very, very useful tool. Another thing I just found out, first off, there's tutorials up here. I haven't even watched any of the tutorials. I've just been going and just learning it on my own and figuring it out. But I just realized and learned that you can teach this program to, like right here, how to program your supplier. You can teach it to paste into any different supplier. So if you guys you know, use Amazon, you'll realize that copying and pasting the address and stuff is different than the way it is on Walmart, different than the way it is on Home Depot, different than the way it is on anything. And as you can watch this video right here, and you can learn, if you use any supplier out there, you can learn how to just program it. Once you program it once, it will automatically work for you and just paste everything in automatically from just, just from remembering it. So that is amazing. I just figured that out as I was just browsing through the tutorials before I made this video. Oh, so I already brought up the tutorials right here. Um, and this is basically it. So it has one for every single different, I mean, a lot of the different platforms that they're used to. I know a ton of people out there use DSM tool. Um, I highly don't suggest it, but you know, they do integrate with DSM tool, it seems, and AutoDS. But so one of the main things I use it for, obviously, is Amazon dropshipping because it's just great to have. There's, I don't think there's any other tools out there that do this for Amazon dropshipping. And my VA, I haven't really taught them how to do it for eBay. I just canceled Smarty Drop completely about two weeks ago, so they're still running on that until I teach them spot and paste, which I think I taught them, yes, a couple days ago. So he, he could be using it at the moment. So basically, you're on eBay, and how do you get all of this? So you can tell they pull out the person's information right here, which you know is all blurred out for you guys. The item's blurred out. But all you really have to do to copy one address at a time and then add it to your cart is just click this copy and add to cart button. That's it. Also, if you want to add multiple items and copy multiple addresses and add multiple items to the cart at once, all you have to do is just check them and scroll down and keep checking off the items. And then you just click copy addresses right here. And it'll take a little while load and do it. So I'll just show you one at a time right here because I just don't want to have to blur out everything. But if you click add to cart, connecting to Amazon, there you go, adding product to cart, product added, opening Amazon cart. It opens up the cart for you and you set up the Amazon cart and then I'm not gonna go through any more of the ordering process here, but as you can see, we pull down, we got all the person's information here, and all you would have to do is just click paste. And that's about it. It's pretty self-explanatory, it's pretty easy, and you know, it, it saves you so much time. You don't have to copy and paste everything. You can drag and drop them if you want one at a time, but that's just, it makes no sense to do so because of the fact that you can actually just program it to click paste and it'll do it all at once for you. So that's how to do it on eBay. Like I said, there's a few programs out there that do it for eBay. Spot and Paste is definitely the best one I've found so far. But what really sets it apart is the fact that it does this for Amazon. It does this for all sorts of other things as well. Web Scraper app. It, it, they're trying to integrate with all these other programs, which is great. That's amazing. So I'm on Web Scraper app right here. These are my people. These are the orders that I have to send out. And literally all you do is click copy right here. It not only copies it, but it then opens up to that item on Walmart as well. So if I click this, I copy it, opens up Walmart for me or whatever my supplier is. It's going to open up for whatever your supplier is. And then there you go. Uh, this is all blurred out, obviously. But if I drop down this button, you can see, hey, this is the person's name. This is everything. That's all of their information. And that's how you do it. You go through the order. You go to the checkout. 
And then all you have to do is just click paste at checkout. There's so many tutorials on this program that Jenny has put up on the, on the Spot and Paste website. So there's really no reason not to buy this program. Like I'm saying, if you have done more than five orders a day for the past couple of weeks by hand, you're going to realize that it sucks. You're going to realize that you want another program out there, but maybe you don't have the margins or you don't want to waste the money on auto ordering yet and you don't have enough orders for auto ordering yet. I say if you're not doing about 75 to 100 orders a day, then you should probably just be using semi-auto ordering because it's a lot easier and it saves you money in the long run. So, like I said, anybody that signs up with the link gets 10% off for the lifetime. If you use the coupon ecomtom at checkout, I always try to get you guys a deal on every single program. There's only been one program so far that has yet to give me a deal and I'm still working with them and I'm going to I'm going to make a video on them pretty soon no matter what, but that's about it. So, I hope you guys see the benefit of having the semi auto ordering address copying just software. It is amazing. There's no reason not to have this. I would not be doing orders by myself for Amazon if I didn't have this, and I wouldn't even subject my VAs to doing this. This is awful. Copying one by one is awful. You're not running into any issues where you know there could be a problem with API or anything like that. All you are is just copying and pasting things. It is a great, very useful program, and I hope you guys love this program as much as I do and find the use out of it that I've found. So. Let me know in the comments below if you guys use this program and how you feel about it because I think that it's a great program. And I know I, I kind of shunned Jenny at first because it didn't work as well as I thought it did, but I, didn't, I also didn't watch the tutorials. I, I'm guilty of it. I'm an asshole. But, you know, I gave it a second chance and I literally love this program. I would not, I would not trade it for anything else. So I hope you guys enjoy it as much as I do and I will see you in the next video. Have a good one.